Hello and welcome. Here's a couple handmade leather pistol holsters I just made and I'll show you the patterns that I made for each pistol. That's a Smith & Wesson 38 Special short barrel and uh, as you can see my pattern is made to fold over like that I, and I pretty well cut it to shape for the top side and leave the bottom side overlapping um, that's just the way I do do that um, when I'm uh, designing a um, holster pattern. After I use it a few times, I'll have a little better idea of where to cut it every time. Um, so I leave a lo little overlap on the bottom. Then I cut my filler piece or gusset to uh, fit like I want it. I didn't make a pattern. Um, for this particular set for the filler but eventually I can figure out exactly what I need if I keep making this style uh, pistol holster. Use a strong durable snap to hold that in and it's uh, fitted to fit about a two inch belt max. As you can tell the leather is uh, uh, kind of a light color and I'll treat that with oil I can either use neat foot oil or 100% or, or um, extra virgin um, olive oil. I use both. Uh, for these, I'll be using olive oil to darken the pistol holders, holsters. Um, I double stitch the uh, holsters on my CB4500 harness stitcher, and uh, you can do it by hand and still make them fairly speedy. I made these two holsters um, in um, about a day. I uh, had to allow for drying time. But now I'm going to apply the uh, olive oil onto the uh, leather. A couple light coats. Maybe let it set a little bit. If I think it needs a little more, I'll apply a little more and kind of color out the leather little sun will darken this leather kind of give it a tan after a while I've got a piece of sheepskin there that I um, use for an applicator I like to hand rub and uh, work the oil in rather than dipping the piece into uh, uh, the oil. It just seems like to me it colors out, makes a prettier finish. If you would like, after your oil has soaked in for a day or so, uh, you can put a protective finish on there with Phoebe's Tan Coat. That's a product that will really make them slick. As you can see, they're pretty nice looking little holsters there. You can build a pair of those in about a day. Thanks for taking your time to watch this, and hopefully it'll give you some ideas on your pistol holsters. Thanks for watching. Appreciate a thumbs up.